Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Nike Edix 71 back at with another video, and uh, so I just want to give you guys a little update. Sorry, I know it's been a while since I've uploaded anything, but uh, I guess I could do a track one. As you see, I have my old Menlo track long sleeve that we had, but um, I've been working a lot. Uh, graduated from school. I've been working in sports. Uh, worked for the Raiders. I worked for the Chargers. I worked for the uh, for Stanford. So even though you might see that Raiders and Chargers stuff up there, not a Raider Charger fan. I'm a Rams fan, and I'm not a Stanford fan, I'm a SC fan. So first off, I wanted to clear that out, but I'll let you guys know I'm now working at a university now, and uh, I mean, I've worked in the different sports, and I mean, I've gotten polos and stuff from each sport, like uh, Raiders, we got a jacket, a polo, t-shirt, stuff like that. With uh, the Chargers, it was, we got like two or three polos, uh, that was about it. And then with Stanford, we got two polos, two t-shirts, two long sleeves, and a jacket and a hat. But now I'm actually decided to step away from the pro scene and the big time schools because I wanted to go to a smaller school, get a little bit more responsibility, get some of my uh, experience in, get my MBA and stuff like that. So now that I'm working back in a small college, we get a lot of gear. And I kind of want to show you guys what the difference is from being an athlete and being on the administrative side is how much gear you actually get. Just to give you guys a little bit of a preview, this is part of it, okay? So let's start it off with, we'll start off with bags. So first off, just one of the first things we got was a little Under Armour with our logo. So just to give you guys some, a little bit more information, this is all stuff from my last year from uh, 2018, 2019. I actually started in November to December. And then I only was there for the semester and then the school year ended and sports were done. So it was like, this is pretty much one semester worth of gear. And, um, we were under armor school last year but this year we are a nike school now and we got loaded with nike gear so i am waiting on a couple more items but once i get that the next video will be up next week so um, hopefully i'll give you guys a little sneak peek of one item on the nike gear because i mean it's pretty awesome but uh so under armor drawstring bag really simple so then we got under armor backpack i use this one a lot all last year and started this year just because my nike bag just came in but uh our logo under armor it's under armor storm backpacks super simple i just got it black because even though our school colors are navy baby blue and gray and white and stuff like in gold uh black just seems super simple and then i got a conference bag so our conference uh so if i ever need an extra backpack i have our conference bag and then on top of that we got uh we went to our soccer team made it to nationals and they were going to Wisconsin and being from California, we weren't ready for the snow and the cold. So they got puffy jackets for everyone. So these to wear on the sidelines and everything. So just a regular standard puffy jacket. I've never had one before. Under Armour logo has a little thing. I don't know what this may be for. Maybe to put heat warmers. Uh, I don't know. Let me know in the comments there. Whoop, anything. And then on the back, it is just a standard Under Armour logo. So that was for Wisconsin or Nebraska or wherever we ended up. But, um... Now I'll show you guys the stuff that we actually got. So to start it off, uh, we got some joggers, some gray joggers, super simple, uh, Under Armour logo. And that's the nice thing is being at some of the small schools, you can choose to get stuff unbranded. So like I could just wear these around if I wanted to. And so then next we have, this one was from the soccer team. So um, working with a small school you get to know the coaches real well you work with them a lot so they like to they'll give you some extra gear that they usually get for the coaches or for the athletes just because they're like hey thank you for helping us out thank you for working with us here you go so i got a pair of under armor um soccer shorts so they're not the the tight fit ones they kind of have the loose bottom and everything but like probably lounge around like these are going to be perfect and i mean i haven't even worn these i still have the logo or the tag on them like that's how much stuff we have so that's that Moving on to the next one, I have Under Armour. These were other from the other soccer team. These were tight fitting. So these ones were the Futbolista pants. And uh, they have the zipper and everything on the side. But these are, these are the more the tight fit. They're really comfortable. I love these, these ones. These are, you could train in them. You could just wear them around. You can wear them out. They look good. But I got these ones. These ones were unbranded. So that was nice. And so now moving on to the jackets. So... I, tennis coach was real nice to me got me one of their uh their jackets so standard quarter zip hoodie uh does the tennis logo it has 
the Under Armour logo down at the bottom where the uh, pocket is. It has Under Armour logo up on the top of the hood. I haven't seen that before, but that was interesting. And then also has the Under Armour logo on the right hand side, but it's nice. It's just a standard pullover quarter zip, but it's really comfortable. I actually like it better than the one I'm about to show you, but it's nice. It's really nice. All right, so the next one is just a really standard fleece. Under Armour baby blue hoodie. We've got the, the anchor just put right in the middle, but just super simple, regular fleece pullover hoodie. Yeah. So next is probably one of my favorite things to wear is the lightweight quarter zip hoodie. So, I mean, I mean, super thin, super lightweight. I mean, you could wear it as a t-shirt or you could put like, if it's a little bit chilly where it's like, eh, it's maybe too hot for a sweatshirt, you throw this on and you're chilling. But uh, this one I got gray logo logo standard has a different type of print half underneath the chest really comfortable though it's funny because uh at menlo we got these during track season so it's like i have this is like my fourth one but this is the first one gray like i have here's my menlo one right here uh sorry it's inside out but uh same one just with the blue and everything i have uh, three of these so i mean i love wearing these i wear ones for training ones for wearing at each place i live i have them just separated everywhere just for us to wear and now another thing i have that kind of goes like these are um these quarter zip just pullovers super lightweight pullover the same type of fabric just doesn't have the hood these ones we just got the logo nothing underneath and then uh yeah that's about it and got two of them so and i mean i haven't worn either of them still they saw the tag so that's great uh, next is another same type, but it actually is a different material. It has a lot more breathability. So all this little white stuff uh, on the on the side, on the going down from the shoulder to the sleeve is all perforated. So it's very breathable, super lightweight, nice and comfy. Uh, it definitely has more of the training. It's not like this one where it's like a, more of like a cotton. This has more of a pro combat type of feel. I mean, it's almost see through of how thin it is, but. Uh, I like this one. I, I wear this one. That's why I don't wear those ones because I have this one. Looks really nice. So, and then uh, heading into the polos because what our school does is we don't have to wear shirt and tie to work or to games. So we wear polos. And so they hook us up with polos. And I mean, whew, we get a lot. So first off, I just got an Under Armour t-shirt. Super plain. But next we have the Under Armour baseball. So this was from the baseball team. Uh, they got me, the, they gave me this one, just white standard cotton type of one, super simple. So then this one was from the golf coach, actually. He gave us one of their golf ones, uh, this time the Under Armour logo and the Mariners logo opposite sides, but navy blue, you got the gray stripes on it, the Under Armour logo on the back, and like I said, I haven't even worn this one. So this one's really nice, I like this one. Uh, now we got the victory polos. Now these are the ones that I got pretty much I got this was the loadout that I got for them because they were pro they were it was either between the victory ones and the color box but because this was 2018 the victories were the new ones so I was like I want the new ones so of course I have the white one Mariners with the gray across the top these are these are what I wear pretty much every day so I have the white one and then I have a secondary white one and then I have a gray one with more gray, different type of gray on the top. Then I have the blue one with the darker blue across the top. So what's really nice is these are my these are my everyday wear. So super comfortable. I love it. But like I said, these are probably going to just be sitting in my closet, my golf shirts. Uh, and when I work for certain sports, because like I said, we're going Nike now. So I had to get all brand new stuff. So that will that'll be the next video. But uh, yeah, these are really comfortable, really nice. Uh, but I can't wait to show you guys my Nike ones. I got them. Uh, they're getting embroidered right now. So be back. But also, um, our how our school does it is once we buy so much stuff from our vendor, we get extra kickback. And so you'll be I'll be giving updates because I know women's soccer. They uh, their coach. I'm really I really like that coach. We've been working a lot together, working on videos and ideas and stuff. So. What I'm doing for him is, he, or what he's doing for me is, he's getting me an extra pullo, Nike pullover that they're getting for the women's soccer team. Uh, like I said, our athletic, for as much stuff as we buy, we get free stuff back. So 
I'll be getting just through the staff. And the whole staff gets, uh, I think it's a polo or we're getting a pullover and or a hoodie. So I'll get like two to three more things from the staff. I'll get one thing from women's soccer. And a lot of the teams just hook me up with some extra gear that they got. So I got, uh, so what they gave the staff last year were these gray Charge Bandit 3 shoes to wear so i mean where it works with our colors they're really comfortable but probably the best thing actually hold on before i even show you the best thing uh we got hats too softball because i was kind of new for softball so i got a hat from softball uh perforated all in the back really nice i like this one and then we have a couple pair of mcu hats uh the school with our colors and everything and then we got the opposite version with the baby blue so four hats uh five or six polos eight jackets eight nine jackets uh well, what else what else three pants three bags and then one thing that i didn't get for free i paid for these but they were much 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 worth it are the hover icons so i went ahead under armor because i was like you know what like the gray looks nice but i want something to wear with the baby blue with the navy like i was like and i already have a pair of the navy shoes that i got from track if you guys want a video on that um, let me know in the comments. I'll do show you what you get as a track athlete. So because I still have all my track gear, but uh, I made these. So standard white, uh, really bad fabric on here. I don't like that. But I used the navy, the baby blue and white digi camo print on these, and I've gotten nothing but comments at these, especially on game days when I'm walking around. Like these definitely pop out. No one, I mean they're they're custom made, so no one around has them, at least at our school. Uh, you got the icons in the middle, uh, just the Under Armour little tab in the middle. But they have the Flyknit stretch fit. And I mean, I have, we got a pair of, what were those? The Nike Epic React Flyknits. And those were awesome. Those were awesome. I love them. I'll show you guys those that we got in uh, the next video. But these are the only things that I can compare to those. Like, these are some of the most comfortable shoes I've ever worn. Like, I also got another pair of the Hovers. That's how comfortable they are. They're all white with uh, navy and gold and stuff. They're, they're really comfortable. So the hovers are probably, if you're going to go with Under Armour shoes, get the hovers. Most comfortable, you'll be super happy. But I thought these were cool because of the fly knit type of uh, sock liner. You don't have to tie them, but highly recommend the hovers. And so that's what we got. That was pretty much one semester, almost one year full of gear. But as you can see, you get way more gear as a administrator and athletic working in athletics than you do as a athlete like the athletes don't get nearly as much gear as this and this was in one semester and like i said we're going nike i got just as much if not more gear and more gear still coming so like it's really crazy to think that the administrative side gets a lot more than the athletes do i mean yeah we're working and stuff like stuff like that we can't wear just anything but still like this is a lot of gear and just to give you guys a heads up i'll show you what we're getting for the nike gear like this is one of their Hyper Breathe long sleeve hooded t-shirts. Man, is it, I mean, I haven't, I've only tried it on. I mean, the tags are still on, but this is probably one of the most comfortable shirts. And I got a few of these. I got a few of the t-shirt styles. I got some great stuff. So prepared this week, keep an eye out. This is what I'm going to be showing you guys. I have a couple, way more stuff to show you. Uh, it'll have polos, jackets, long sleeves, t-shirts, shoes, all that good stuff. So Make sure you guys like, subscribe, comment. Uh, let me know what you guys think about this with having so much gear as on the administrative side compared to athletes. I mean, of course, the D1 schools are going to give you a lot of gear. And I mean, I think as like, uh, if you've seen, uh, there was a thing, uh, it was Oklahoma. Oklahoma coach got, they, he showed all his gear. And I was like, he got a lot of gear. Don't get me wrong. But as an administrative person and an admin for my school, I think I got just as much gear as he did, and he's at Oklahoma. So uh, let me know what you guys think. Like, comment, subscribe, share it, do what you guys got to do. Thank you guys. Sorry for the delay, but I'll be promised to bring you guys back another one next week. Have a good one.